The Habsburgs ruled as Holy Roman Emperors. While historians joke their domain was neither holy nor Roman, they did have some fancy jewels. The Imperial Treasury shows off the best jewels on the continent. Visitors reflect on the glitter of 20 rooms filled with the precious paraphernalia designed to help keep one royal family ruling a good part of Europe. This 500-year-old unicorn horn, or perhaps the tusk of a narwhal, was considered very powerful in the Middle Ages. Possessed by the Habsburg Emperor, a divine monarch, it gave its owner the grace of God, something rulers still seek today. The collection's highlight is the 10th century crown of the Holy Roman Emperor. The symbolism indicates that the emperor was both holy and Roman. The jeweled arch represents the parade helmet of ancient Roman emperors, whose successors the Habsburgs claimed to be. The cross says the emperor ruled as Christ's representative on earth. King Solomon's portrait is Old Testament proof that kings can be wise and good. King David is similar proof that they can be just. The crown's eight sides represent the celestial city of Jerusalem's eight gates. The precious stones in the front panel symbolize the 12 apostles. The 11th century imperial cross preceded the emperor in ceremonies. Encrusted with jewels, it carried what was believed to be a substantial chunk of the cross. Through the centuries, the Holy Roman Emperors actually carried this into battle. You can see bits of the so-called true cross anywhere, but this is a prime piece with an actual nail hole 